In this video, I'm going to be talking about Elon Musk, specifically why I think he's such a great guy and why I think buying Twitter was one of his greatest accomplishments and what specifically he's done that no media has talked about. That is one of the most brilliant things Twitter has ever done. So Twitter, as we all know, is a social media that you text on, you type on, and recently Elon Musk bought Twitter, I think it was around six months ago, if I'm correct, he bought Twitter for over $40 billion. It's a lot of money, that, but he bought Twitter for that much money. And ever since then, it's been valued at half that, it's been valued at $20 billion. So it's just gone down, down, and down in value since Elon Musk has bought Twitter. And people are saying that Elon Musk buying Twitter is one of the worst things that's happened to Twitter. And every decision he's made has scared away the advertisers, which it has. He's lost a lot of advertising money. And it's scared away people from using Twitter, which I'm not so sure about that. And that the value of Twitter has dropped in half, which it has. But I'm going to tell you one specific thing, why I think Twitter has become better since Elon Musk has, has bought it. And one thing, and this one thing is something that no media, no public media has talked about really. Nothing that I have ever seen. I've, no, I've never seen anyone talk about this one specific thing that has made Twitter so much better. Besides for it being open source, which means letting the coding out to the public and people can see their coding, which, which what is what built Twitter's infrastructure. Up till now, it's been all private. No one's ever said anything. All social media is totally private in what they do, but Elon Musk said, we're releasing it, we're keeping it open source, and now everyone can see our coding and see what we're doing wrong, see what we're doing good, and we can improve it with people's feedback. But then the specific thing that I think has made Twitter so great is the point about what is a true and what is a lie. So people keep posting stuff, and up till now there's been such a huge debate. When do we take it down? Is it a, if it's true, if it's a lie, you can't post lies, etc., etc., etc. Now Elon Musk has let users edit other people's tweets, not edit other people's tweets, add context to other people's tweets and leave notes below other people's tweets. As long as you're in the program, you can leave notes between other people's, below other people's tweets saying, we suggest this or we suggest that. Let's say someone posts something and, we, and they could post underneath that tweet saying, um, the statistics don't agree with this post or stuff like that. So to, to show where the proof's at, to show where this truth's at. So I think that's such an amazing thing because First of all, he's solving this problem of truth versus a lie. Is it true or is it a lie? You can just see below whether the user's feedback. Second of all, by getting users involved, it's such a clever technique because it's totally for free. He's saving, saving himself millions and millions and millions, if not more. And he's doing a bit what, Wikip what made Wikipedia great is by getting users' feedback and making users the central aspect of Wikipedia itself. Now, that's what they've done to Twitter. He, that's what he's done to Twitter. That's what Elon's done to Twitter. He's, been, he's letting readers join a program like Wikipedia and letting them leave comments below on other people's tweets. Not just comments, but specifically proof of statistics that are attached to that tweet so people can see context to it. I think it's an incredible idea. It's free. It gets us users in involved. And it tells well, what's a true and what's a lie. And it gives context to each tweet. I think that's one of the greatest things that he's done. And no one has talked about it, which is such a shame because it's such a huge, amazing thing that he's done. Um, and I think specifically because of techniques like this, which is so different, which is so, is so creative, I think this is one of the things that's going to make Twitter one of the greatest one, one of the greatest social media platforms. I mean, I hope so. I mean, it already is in the top five social media platforms, along with like sort of YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, if you even include Facebook anymore. Um, but it already is one of the most used social media platforms, but I don't think it's going down on anything. The only way up, well, the only way is up, really. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching this video, and let me know what you think in the comments.